quick questions. Uh, one, I heard yesterday uh, that the deadline for employers to to get into the system has been pushed back. It was supposed to be earlier this year. Now they're pushing it back to 2015, and I'm wondering what impact that's going to have on the size of the pool. Um, and what impact, particularly here in California, providers, I read a couple days ago, we've had now uh, United Health join Aetna. Uh, I had individual coverage for 20 years. It kept going up and up to the point I was uninsured for four to 16 months, and I had a disaster 64 days before I got Medicare. Uh, <laughs> um, what impact the insurer is pulling out, particularly here in California? There are a couple of insurance uh, policies in California that are not going to be offering a policy for individual coverage. Uh, Aetna and United Healthcare, they decided that they want to stick with their own business model. But in the exchange, uh, in the exchange, how, how many? Six in LA. Six in LA are going to be offering insurance. So that would give some choices. I think that um, when, when people see how well it's going to work, a lot of the insurance companies will reevaluate it and, and it will be a little bit more successful. It's going to take time to, to phase in. We're trying to get an outreach to people to let them know they can get insurance and let them know they should be getting insurance. So, uh, they have two requirements. One is for individuals. All individuals are supposed to have health insurance. And if you don't get health insurance, you have to pay a, a penalty on your taxes. And for businesses that have more than 50 employees, they are obligated to provide coverage or to pay a penalty. And uh, that was supposed to be a way of getting them to be part of the system. Well, I think that uh, the administration was hearing so many complaints, they decided let's get this thing in place and we'll put that part off for a year. And, uh, I think that their thinking was that uh, for most businesses that have 50, more than 50 employees, 95% covered their insurance for their employees. It's the ones that are smaller than 50. And if you're at a small business, working for a small business of 50 employees or less, you go into the exchange. So individuals still get insurance, but some of the small businesses may not want to participate the first year, but they'll be required to do it in the second year.